You know, you all have your uh, bucket list. Um, what you're supposed to do before you kick the bucket. And uh, on my bucket list is to finally to bear my testimony in front of my missionary companions after 35 years. I, I've been fair, fearful to do that. And uh, I wanted to take this opportunity. You know, after two months coming into the mission uh, field, by, by the way, my name is Robert Warnick. On my bucket list was to be as big as Elder Two someday, and uh, I made it. Um, I was much smaller back then. But after two months of my mission, uh, after being in the mission, I was able to go into the mission home, which was a wonderful experience for me. I spent half of my time in the mission home with, with the other mission president, uh, President Walker, and, uh, and then I spent with the Ontiveros family as well. And what a great experience it was to be able to spend time with those wonderful families and with the wonderful elders who lived in the mission home. My first month in the mission home, I had two companions, Elder Holbrook, and Elder Neff, and they attempted to teach me how to drive one of those white Dotsons. And I was not very good at it. In fact, I think I hold the record for the most car accidents on missions. Anyone beat three? Uh, one of them was in the president's car in the back of the bus. And I remember that's what folletos are for, is that when the police show up, you can keep them entertained while uh, Elder Kirkham and Elder Stokes drive off with the car and they'd be standing there uh, preaching the gospel to, a, to one of the police officers who keep out of jail. Um, so I'm sorry that I, I wasn't a very good student. But I had some wonderful experiences in the mission.